Actually, wide surveying actually appointed Doc9 to do some uh, usability testing and yes. a, a digital experience audit on one of your products recently. Home fact. Indeed. What was that experience like working with on that audit? Yeah, really, really good and really, really um, pleasing to see the results. Um, you know, we'd never, we'd never gone into any sort of greater degree of in-depth analysis mm. of the product. We'd relied on your traditional old sort of, well, I call it old-fashioned, likes of NPS and, mm -hmm. and that marking. So to get that degree of input, what that allows us to do then is that we we, we know we've got a very good product and it's called Home Fact. Um, I'll say it again, Home Fact. So if people <laughs> want to buy it, it's called Home Fact. We'll put a link in the, uh, in the description. <laughs> but um, the, the, to get proper analysis of what the consumer says is very, very important. Mm. Um, and then what it does then is helps to shape and build what the next iteration of that product will be. Mm -hmm. Because we've been very, very clear about it. And I think that what we spoke about today, really, Mark, is very, very clear about it, is that survey products need to fit what the consumer wants. Mm -hmm. And if they don't, there's no point selling them. There's no point in having them. Mm -hmm. So home fact uh, for us was the start of that journey of change of actually really getting down to it. So you mm -hmm. guys helped us enormously. Um, Great to hear. And, and, you know, we may be back for more. Sounds good. And, and as part of that project, we got real users in, you know, consumers in and tested it. And, and, well, actually, it was the work uh, done remotely. Uh, was that the first time you kind of heard, you know, real users using yes. a product? What was that like? Was yes. It an experience? Um, well, well, I suppose it was challenging and um, brave of us to do it in the first place mm. because they could have shot it down in flames and something mm. that we would put up there on a flagpole saying look at our product isn't it fantastic um, but on the other hand it was absolutely reassuring to hear that we have got the vast majority of it right mm -hmm. but there are some areas to work on and that's great um, if you don't keep doing that if you don't keep bringing in the actual person that's buying the products and getting their real real feedback on whether they think one it's value for money or fit for purpose mm. then you're never going to succeed in, yes. in in business anyway